This video taken Christmas Day resurfaced online this week. An Indigenous woman restrained by staff at the Marlboro Hotel. It raised questions of the treatment of Indigenous people in Winnipeg. In 2014, 26-year-old Colton Pratt was last seen at the Marlboro. He's been missing ever since. And for his mom, Lydia Daniels, the video brought back a wave of emotions. And it triggered me and brought me back to that first few days where he went missing. So it's been pretty tough. And the last thing I said to him, I said, I am worried about you. Be careful. And then he said, I know, Mom. Hotel staff and Winnipeg police say the woman in the video was restrained for brandishing a knife. Using zip ties was justified, according to police. The woman has been charged with assault with a weapon. She also faces the same charge from an incident that happened in September 2023. The video and history of the Marlboro sparked a lot of anger and tension between the hotel and the Indigenous community. In 2013, two Winnipeg men faced prostitution charges after police broke up an alleged brothel operating out of two hotels, one of which was the Marlboro. But the current staff say they are getting threats. The hotel is temporarily closed. In a statement, the general manager told APTN this is extremely unsettling to our staff and management who fear for their safety. For now, the doors are closed and Winnipeg police are investigating. Tamara Pimentel, APTN National News, Winnipeg.